saying it, cheat. Oh! Oh, oh, this this video isn't it, cheap. No, chief. Shut up. I promise you that with my microphone, this, this video is gonna be decent, right? We're gonna make some good content today, and we're just gonna discuss anything, anything fashion news. Comment section. Here's your job for the day. Make fun of my nose. What is that? And uh. Yeah, it probably wasn't funny. I don't care. But we're just gonna get in this video, discuss anything fashion news we found, uh, from Kanye West to Supreme North Face. Just anything in title, I'm gonna be discussing, and some more stuff, you know, I just wanna discuss. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Again, if you haven't already, enter in that giveaway down below. Subscribe, like, follow my boy Vintage Flame, of course, because he's doing part of the giveaway with me. So if you all wanna do all that, you can. It's optional, it's all down below in the description, but it's free, so. Why not? You know, apparently it's an incentive, but uh, yeah, let's get started. Lighting ain't half bad. Um, I do look loud, like I have makeup on though with this lighting, which cool, I guess. But basically, Kanye's back in Instagram. That's the first thing I want to discuss. All right, I know this isn't like, too much to do with fashion news, but actually I'm gonna tie it into it because Kanye, on his Instagram, even though he's been posting a lot about his new album, Yandi, coming out September 29th, I'm excited for it. I've heard some snippets that sounded pretty decent. I'd say I like sort of the vibe of it we're gonna have. Combining a lot of things we see nowadays with his style, and you know, personally, I like his style. I know, like, Lose Yourself isn't necessarily something I'd like to see on this album. Hopefully we don't, but, uh, yeah, you know, I think that was just a marketing grab. Lose yourself, genius. I personally think he got everyone's attention with it. Super smart. But aside from that, he has been posting some things about some new Yeezy style will be coming out. So here is actually like a picture of some some things we'll be in C. Um, and for me, I'm like, this is such a short cool. I like this. This is, this is going to be the Yeezy 700 V2. I think it's the other. I think it's a V2, and this is what it's going to look like. It's coming out January 12th, supposedly, um, and this is what it's going to look like. I personally like it. I'm a huge fan of the 700 model, so for me, it's a top. All right, so you know that's just a bit of a bias thing right there. I just love the 700 model. Being real, it's fire. I think it's fire. All right, I'm not just a Kanye stan. I'm just saying I like the, the whole design of them, but these aren't the only ones. On just Twitter. Also, you know, he posted something about in 2019 how we're going to be seeing a ton of different Yeezys. So, like, um, actually, we we'll put like this picture of his sketches, like all that. Look at that. We got 700 V3, four Yeezy 451, 451. I don't, I don't understand it. 500 V2. So, you know, we're gonna have a Desert Rat V2 or something like that. A Yeezy basketball shoe, 350 V3. Honestly, I don't think we need any th more 350s. Like, Kanye, Kanye, we don't need more 350s. All right, the 350, the 350 stack. All right, that died. Ah. Uh, I'm trying to think of a joke, I just don't have any, but uh, yeah, you know, 350, we don't need any more. That's what I'm just thinking. Also, you know, we got the 1050, so that's a whole different thing. It looks like a winter boot um, with like boosters. I, I can't even tell what this sketch really is, but we got that coming. And we also got the Yeezy Terex coming. I don't have any pictures of that, but the Yeezy basketball shoe, I do have pictures of, matter of fact. So here's what they look like. Kanye posted this, it has like 350,000 likes. This has a ton of likes. Um, but a lot of people are active on Kanye's Instagram right now because he's a genius. He knows he knows that when he came back on Instagram, people are gonna come to it. You know, he just posts a bunch of controversial things on Instagram, starts beef, not really, and yeah, there you go. He's back, back in the mainstream. That is easy. That he disappeared for five years, come back, fame like famous again. It's crazy. Um, but looking at that, here's the picture of the Yeezy basketball shoe. For me, uh, this like for me this this is this is not this, this, ain't right? cheap. this chief. No, sorry. But I mean, being real, like for me, it just I don't I don't see it. Uh, but Yeezy basketball, he's I would like to see Yeezy actually like maybe I know they won't be real sponsor an athlete or give him to an athlete early. I think may, they may give him to an athlete early in like the NBA. I think that would be cool. I could see Kanye doing that. There's a Kanye move for marketing. I could see it. Somebody like close with sort of that's like in the NBA. Just give him the shoes. Give him to wear him a game. Not everyone wants Yeezys. That that's what I think. Just. I, that's what I see. It's an easy opportunity, and Kanye knows he could do it. It's just Kanye, all right? We need the, this is a marketing Kanye, all right? Kanye can honestly stop making music and just be a marketing genius and make millions. We all know that he could do that. It's just, he's so smart. Okay, he's smart in some ways, not not in all ways. We know that. Every, every second, ready? Here they come. Come on. Next story though, we do have more news. All right, Team Star sent me some things. Uh, he actually sent me this matter of fact, and he sent me the fact that Michael Kors has bought what Versace for 2.12, to be exact, 2.12 billion dollars. Uh, and they're gonna change Versace's name to Capri Holdings. Uh, I personally think that's a terrible name, I'm gonna be real. Um, sorry, Michael, Michael Kors, I doubt you'll watch this, but if you do, Michael. First off, what's up? How, I don't even know how you got here, but secondly, why? Just leave it at Versace. Like that's what everyone knows it as. A lot of people know Versace. Um, just 
Leave it at that. That's a suggestion. I'm not a fashion expert, but just, hey, just, that's what I think. So Versace bought out, sold for $2.1 billion. So, uh, you know, some someone's very rich now. Someone just made a lot of money. I mean, I mean, I, I don't know. I don't want to flex, but you know, my video a couple days back, I did have a Versace ring. And uh, so technically I bought Versace before, you know. They, they sold out. I know, I know, I'm bragging, I'm sorry. Here, listen to this. My cat's scratching at my door, look. Second I stop talking, Second I stop talking, they stop doing it. It's, that's that's logic right there, that's life. Next up though, uh, we got like some Supreme. Say hello to my cat. That's my dog. But uh, yeah, it's after my cat. We do have some Supreme TNF leaks. Um, I know y'all are all waiting for the Supreme TNF because you know, a ton of people were excited for Supreme CDG. Now I got Supreme TNF on the way. Now looking at the Supreme North Face, like we got some teeth, all right? Um, they're just like t-shirt mock-ups is what I think, but you know, again, I'm still gonna discuss mock-ups, anything like that, and you know, these are not bad, I think. I personally like the design of the tee, the colorways, you know, basic ones we've seen. Oh, that's my cat. But yeah, the colorways are fine. I don't, I think the person on it is just sitting there. Um, it's like someone that I think, I don't know, there's someone wearing North Face, but obviously it's an older photo, so I think it's someone like that climbed a high mountain, possibly like, I'm just gonna assume like something like Mount Everest, can you know, Supreme and do something like that? Or just like a high mountain, like a tall, obviously a tall mountain. To be wearing all that clothes, you gotta be caught. You gotta be, you gotta be climbing something pretty high, all right? But uh, yeah, I could have made a joke there, but I'm not gonna do that. But yeah, you know, t-shirt mock-ups are sort of cool, but for me, I don't, I don't know. I don't know about this one. Like, it, they're cool, but let's like, I don't know. I don't know. These, they're mock-ups for a reason, all right? But I think it's actually probably gonna be close to it, because there was like some one with like pictures of five, and they had like tags and things like that. So it could be it. I don't know. I don't know. All right, just they're fine. They're sort of cool. My voice, <coughs> but uh, yeah. You know, I was talking like old man there for a second. I don't know what was up. A couple other cool things. These may not necessarily have to do with fashion, but Lil Wayne dropping his album on the 27th. I would assume it would be like midnight tonight, because today's the 26th and it turns the 27th at 12.01 a.m. So I think that would make sense if he did that, because he's probably gonna be up for his birthday. I know him. It, well, not, I don't know him, but like, you know. But I think you could, could just any time on the 27th, obviously, so it's going to be a drop. He said his birthday, and his birthday starts then. So that's what I'm thinking. And also, something I sort of noticed, and I don't know if this is relevant at all, nor do I know how long this has been going on for, but Supreme New York is following Palace. Supreme follows Palace um, on Instagram. I assume they probably have for a while. I just I just noticed it. But, uh, you know, that's always, you know, it's a thing. It's a stretch to say that Supreme and Palace would be clapping. But I'm saying, when one brand, like that big, follows another brand that's also big, it's sort of a sign because i don't know if supreme follows bait but you know yeah like they don't follow bait so they follow palace but they don't follow bait and that's that's just a bit of a flag for me I, you know like hey we could be seeing a club it's a stretch it's a huge stretch i'm just saying that's what i sort of see i really do look like i'm wearing makeup though like look at me right now i look like a I look like 10 from like Barbie doll, dude. This is not even chill. This, this is not chill. Anyways, thank you all for watching this video. I hope you all did enjoy it in some sort of way. That wasn't funny, so if you laughed, I feel bad for you. Um, But uh, yeah, thank you all for the love you all been sharing, uh, showing. I still can't speak. I'm so tired, I'm still sick. But yeah, I just hope you all did enjoy this video. I appreciate it. Hopefully, you know, it was somewhat funny or just you guys learned something about the fashion. You know, we got a lot of things going on right now. Kanye has been active. And we got a lot of things coming up in like music and things like that. Music, I think, and fashion tie closely together. Just, you know, some of, some of the albums and things. It depends on who it is, I think. But I just hope you all did enjoy. Subscribe, like if you're new. Enter that giveaway down below for 20K. It ends in like a week, I think. So go enter that before it ends. And uh, yeah, now my cats are messing with the Gatorade bulb. So thank you all for watching. Appreciate every single one of y'all. And uh, yeah, peace out.